That year, the competition at the uh, camp was extremely tough. It was the most talented group of kids that I'd found in the five years of going out and looking for Mouseketeers with Britney and Justin and Christina. I do remember when Britney Spears came in because she looked a lot like Jessica. I looked at her and I looked at my husband and I was like, whoa. I mean, like, Justin Timberlake had done Star Search. Christina Aguilera had been singing, like, incredibly for quite a while now. So it was uh, pretty overwhelming to get down there and then see all these kids with this amazing talent. You know, they had resumes and they had portfolios with these, you know, great pictures and pictures of the events they had done. Jessica had a Polaroid. That's all we had, and we didn't know we were supposed to have anything else. And we had no experience, so we had no resume either. It was like, whoa, okay, we're maybe a little out of our league here. We had this very intense three-day sort of mouse club training camp where they had intense acting, singing, and, and dancing classes. The last day, they have to do this full-on, like, performance, basically. Right before... Jessica was supposed to do her thing. She came into the green room. And it was up on the TV, the little monitor was. And she starts watching. And the girl that went in front of her was Christina Aguilera. And so Jessica starts watching her. And she just sat there with her mouth open. I gotta tell you, I wouldn't want to follow Christina Aguilera. <laughs> It intimidated the heck out of her because she was just like, oh, it hit her. She's like, oh my gosh, this is my competition. I've got to be as good as her. She was next, so she went out to perform. And it's all done in front of the camera, and Jessica had never done camera work before. And she had four cameras and lights slamming her. And this is her first time ever out in a situation like that. It was just like a deer looking at headlights. She forgot words to her song. She blew the acting audition. Tana and I were sitting there going, oh my God, <laughs> what just happened to our baby? I will never forget when she walked out the door that Justin Timberlake was standing right there and he looked at her like, you know, with his mouth like wide open, like, oh, Jessica, you just messed it up bad. We knew in our gut, we're done. We're you know, keep this the family is, together. This is not gonna happen start doing the whole process of recording and it's just seeming to take a long time. You only get one chance to make a first impression and it's very important that it be right. In the process of all of this, there's these other two girls that are starting to come out. We knew that, you know, there was a girl named Brittany coming out. And we flip on MTV and we see this cute little girl with these great big brown eyes. That girl looks really familiar. Oh my gosh, that's the girl from the Mickey Mouse Club. And we knew there was a girl named Christina coming out. She goes, boy, this girl can sing. It's Christina Aguilera. And I looked at Jessica and I'm like, oh, that's the girl! It's almost like you could be viewed as following in their shadow, like you're still trying to keep up. It was just difficult to watch these other girls have success when, you know, she was waiting for that as well. Come, come, come on and meow. Here we are again, and it's Brittany and Christina, the two people that beat her in the Mickey Mouse Club, and now they're going to come out before her. Now she's running in third place, going, oh, great. You know, she's getting really anxious, like, when it's my turn, when's, when's my turn, you know? And she still doesn't have this record finished yet. 